Hello everyone, welcome to Preschool Art. My name is Miss Lindsay and today we are going to make some coffee filter process art. So we are going to need a coffee filter, some washable markers, and a spray bottle or a bowl with some water in it. Um, and you might also want a piece of cardboard or some paper to put underneath your project just in case the markers bleed through or the water bleeds through. Um, so our first step is to color our coffee filter. So there are two ways of doing this. You can either color over the entire coffee filter like I did here, or you can fold your coffee filter into four pieces and color one side. So that's what I'm going to do here. Um, take my marker, start coloring. Can make some shapes if you like. This is going to um, create sort of a tie dye effect. So it's up to you how you want to color this part. And add some purple. Carry away there. All right. So our next step is to take our spray bottle and spray our coffee filter, and that will cause the marker to bleed over the rest of the paper. Starting to bleed through. We'll add a little bit more water here. Give it some extra help. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and let that dry. And we'll add some water to this one as well. You can see how all of those colors bleed into each other. Okay, and then we're going to go ahead and let those dry. All right, so I let those dry. Um, so now you see that we have some very fun tie-dye coffee filters. This is the one that I had folded into quarters. You can see how the colors spread out. And then this is the one that I drew designs all over. I think I probably added too much water to this one. <laughs> so don't, don't, don't go too crazy with the water. All right, so from here you can hang these up as sun catchers in your window, or you can even cut them out into shapes, maybe some hearts and stars, and put those up in your window. Um, so I hope you have fun doing this project. Um, everybody stay safe and healthy, and we hope to see you soon. Bye.